What's happening, everybody? Sean joined again by my son, Trey. And today on Reactions to the Classics, we got a song battle reaction to editors and their songs, All Sparks versus Papillon, brought to us by our friend, longtime supporter, and patron of the channel, CSN. Appreciate you, CSN. Appreciate all the patrons who make this thing go. We couldn't do it without you. We put up videos every single day. If you'd like to support us in any way, check out the Patreon link below or the patron link on the end screen. Tell Tell us a little bit about editors. Right? Yeah, I uh, you familiar with them? At all? I have never heard of them. Tell no. us same same here. But uh, they're an English rock band formed in two thousand and two. They um, consist of Tom Smith on the lead vocals and guitar, uh, Russell Leach on the bass and the synth, Ed Lay on the drums, and Justin Lockie on lead guitar. So um, looking looking forward to checking it out. They released two platinum studio records, six in total, several million combined in sales. Uh, their brand of dark indie rock is commonly compared to the sounds of Echo and the Bunnymen, Joy Division, Interpol, The Chameleons, and U2. I'm a fan of literally all of them. I was going to say, so. me as well. So you can see below, we're going to start out with All Sparks from the Backroom album, which is their 2005 debut. Nice. It's the fourth single off this album, went to 21 in the UK. We're going to have the lyrics up as always. Thanks again, CSN. Tell they can write a riff. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> quite enjoying the uh, guitar tone that uh, we're getting on this thing too. Sure. Most punk vibes. Sparks, you mentioned to Trey that they know how to ride a riff. That guitar riff was fantastic. The bass work that came in later, and uh, I thought the vocal performance was really good. A little, little drawn out start and start, start and stop in that first verse, mm -hmm. and then they just kind of uh, 
you kind of rolled with it from there. No, definite, uh, you know, 80s post-punk yes. vibes uh, on this track right here. Um, a touch of Ian Curtis' vocals from uh, yeah. Joy Division and the verses uh, more so than the uh, the chorus. And uh, again, I thought it was a tale of two songs where the, the chorus was uh, um, just really melodic and, and, and catchy. Yeah. Um, and, and the verses kind of, uh, you know, drawing into that, um, you know, heavier bass line and, and darker atmosphere right there. But uh, I really enjoyed this one and, you know, kind of self-explanatory, right? All sparks will burn out in the eddy. Uh, uh, he said, notes, you're answering questions that have not yet been asked. Uh, later on, he says, you're casting opinions at people who need them. Um, and, you know, just that motif of all sparks will burn out in the end. Um, well, be careful, angel. This life is just too long. All sparks will burn out in the end. You know, there's there's an end to everything. There's an end to everything. Don't think you're so self-important that uh, everything you have to say, everybody cares about. All right, now we're going to go. To, I'm going to say it as Papillon. I mean, I'm going to get fancy here and say it as <laughs> as that, Trey. This one is uh, from their In This Light and, out, and On This Evening. In 2009, their third album. It went to number one in the UK. It's funny, we've never heard these. We come across this yeah. all the time. This was the lead single. Charted in several countries, including Belgium, where it's the number one hit, and the UK, where it peaked at 23. Mm -hmm. And as of the year 2020, it remains their last UK okay. top 40 hit. Let's do it. All right, more dance already, obviously. Make our escape. You're my own papillon. I said it right. I didn't know, man. The world turns too fast. Feel love before it's gone. It kicks like a sleep twist. Like a sleep switch That sleep switch kicks Yeah <laughs> That one
All right, Papillon. Now, Trey, I've never been to the UK. What do I own a UK dance club? But this song <laughs> seems like the late 80s, early 90s. Oh, the, yeah. This thing should have been jamming. Then, like These guys were needed to rewind time like in the best possible way. I don't even think the lyrics of this song are all that important. It's just the, the synth is great, that little melody and riff in there, Tom's vocals. I mean, what do you think well, of this? Well, yeah, that, a total left turn uh, from what I expected. Yeah, uh, me too. Out of All Sparks, which, uh, you know, was more, in my opinion, post-punk inspired. This, obviously... Uh, had that the synth pop uh, yes. uh, sound to it right here. But so, still with that voice of Tom, it oh, seems like it should yeah. be on the post punk. So yeah. shout out to Russell Leach uh, on on synths right here yeah. and uh, Papillon, uh, a word that I'm gonna be honest, I never heard until today. So I know, remember I the movie. Here. That's the only reason why I've ever heard of it. I admit I didn't see the movie. Okay, but. it it's, uh, it means butterfly. So that's kind of. Uh, you, I did not you, know that. You got some of those um, illusions in in here uh, at a couple different uh, at a couple different points, um, or maybe I'm just thinking of the idea of a uh, you know kind of uh, being reborn in a sense. But I, I don't know. But uh, I, I love the build up to uh, the it kicks lack like of sleep twitch. twitch. The, the the way that line was delivered was great, and then boom, you go into the really danceable chorus as you're mentioning that. And um, again, I think just shows how editors can. Uh, pull off to totally different types of uh, sounds and Agreed. songs, you know, not that I know their catalog, but just uh, based on these two, uh, you can tell the talent of the band there. Um, and yeah, man, I, I can see why this was a, a top 40 hit indeed right here. But um, I guess that that'll take us to, uh, to our winner right here. Um, you know, a, a tale of two genres, two styles. I'm going to land on all sparks for me. Um, just cause I, I did enjoy how, um, how, how catchy that chorus was, not not to say Papillon wasn't, of course, yeah. as well, but um, I don't know, I just kind of like the dichotomy of that track between the verses and the chorus, and um, yeah, just the, the post-punk uh, influences. Yeah, and I'm going to be there with you, although it's tough, man, because Papillon really did kick like a sleep twitch. So, <laughs> That's I mean, right. It's hard to not name it my favorite, because it was really good, but I'm going to go with All Sparks, just barely, but uh, we need your help, guys. What do you guys think of this one? What do you think, who do you think won? Uh, leave it in the comments below. Do we get this right or are we totally wrong? <laughs> Thanks again to CSN for bringing it. Yeah, and if you'd like to have us do a song battle or reaction for you, you can check out our Patreon page, uh, get early access, a bunch of cool stuff over there as well. But uh, that'll do it from us today. So until next time, y'all, thanks for watching. Happy listening, and we will see you.